Welcome to Cinerama TV. I'm Miss Kelly. Today, Papa Tom is going to show us how to build a teepee, and he'll be using our building and structure kit. Some other things that you'll need are a pencil, some markers, and a hobby knife or scissors. Okay, let's pay close attention and watch Papa Tom as he shows us how to build a teepee. Okay, today's subject: the American Indian teepee. How do we go about making it? Well, very, very simple, really. Get yourself out of the building and structure kit. It has a nice piece of cardboard in there we can make for a template, and it's quite simple because the teepee is nothing more than a half a circle. So, get one of Mom's bowls, put it down on top of it. Take a pencil, draw a circle, and take your straight edge. Draw right down through the center, so now you have a half a circle. So what we need to do is put in a door, half the door, and half the door over here, as they'll meet together, making the full circle. And then this flap right here, the overlap flap, is where they stitch it through with bone. And this is the flap for the ventilation. And that's this one down here. Now all we need to do, because we've got it drawn on, is just cut it all out. Kids, be sure to ask mom or dad for help when using anything sharp, such as scissors or a hobby knife. When you put it all together and it comes around, it'll overlap like that, making your teepee. Now that we have our stencil done, we're ready to continue on with a taking out the construction paper that's in the kit and our canvas. And we're going to stick it onto the construction paper just to give it a little more body so it can be turned and, and put together without flimsy flopping all over the place. And in the building kit it also has project glue and just take it, squirt it into a container, mix it with water and with a brush, whether it be a regular brush or a foam brush, whatever you have at home, just paint it on the sheet. Now we just have to take and place our canvas on top of it. And we'll just let that dry a little bit. Now that our cement has dried, we're ready to take our template that we made and trace it just in case we move it onto our canvas with a pencil. Now just take the same razor blade knife very carefully or a pair of scissors and cut it out. And it'll go together just like that. And we'll cement this flap under my thumb right over the other one. American Indian used to decorate their teepee with different colors using the dyes that they made from the earth and berries and stuff. We're going to want to put something right here or right here. It's easier to do it while it's still flat. So let's put it down flat. And if you go into your public library or on the internet, you can get a hold of different pictures of Indian type paintings that they would have done in that time period. And then to put those on, you can use paints or felt markers. Did you know it is believed that the first Thanksgiving was celebrated by the Pilgrims and Indians back in 1621? Abraham Lincoln declared Thanksgiving a national holiday almost 250 years later in 1863. Don't laugh guys, this is the first time at the deer. Basically something just like that. So when you get it together, you now have a story that he's an Indian that was out hunting. So now it's time to put our teepee together. All we have to do is put a little project glue on the tabs, spin it around, line it up there where the two tabs are, put that paper clip on there because it's going to be a while for it to dry up properly. I have one more paper clip for this bottom one. He's wanting to pop a little bit right at the moment. You're going to be putting in your sticks like you see here. So go and get your sticks out of your project kit and just kind of sand them into a point 
like you see right here, we really need six for inside and then we need two for the outside out here. Cut six of them so that they're all the same length. So now it's a matter of just getting our poles inside and evenly spaced around. Just run a bead of glue down to the center and up to the edge and drop a pole in. Okay. Now that we've got them all in one place, what we want to do is let this dry a little bit because we want the sticks to stay where they are um, until they dry. A lot of times the Indians used to have a flap on the front of their teepee. Let's take a little bit of our leftover canvas that we used when we cut it out and uh, we'll make that flap and with our leftover sticks that we cut off earlier we will take a piece that's oh just a little bit longer on each side of it and then very carefully split it down and split it again and that'll be our two pieces right there as we have here and the other thing they did is on the front they would lace them up with pieces of bone or stick in order to keep the teepee together. So let's do the same thing with this other piece that we have left over. We'll cut oh, pieces of about that big and then split those to where they're a lot smaller, about the size that a, that bow would have been or the pin or the stick. Now let's cement this, the sticks on to this one. And that will give us the flap for the front of the teepee when it's dry. Let's check out our teepee now. It seems to be dry. We can pull our paper clips off. And uh, nothing left to do but add the, the details that we just made for it. We can take our little sticks, put a little project glue on it, put the sticks. So they're right in the front like this. And now our little doorway that we made earlier, we can take a little cement on it and place it in position. position. And there you have your teepee. All set to go. All you need now to do is to have a nice little layout to put it on top of. Now that we've got our teepee finished, I know you're dying to find out what it looks like on a layout. Well, I just happen to have one here. Let's slide this over. I'll bring a layout in and let's say we put them over here in this little tucked area how about let's put a background if we had that we'd sure want to know what a background looked on it so we'll put that in place to learn how to make this great looking diorama and backdrop, check out Papa Tom's American Indian Diorama video. Don't forget the most important thing, put your name on and get that A.